morning students welcome to online class today we are going to see rural administration in civics usually gram panchayat looks after the administration of a village but it is not possible for the panchayat alone to deal with the numerous issues and problems that the people of the village might face on a daily basis thus the panchayat is aided in this task by some institutions and officials here we will discuss about police station land records patwari tehsildar right of property to women resolving land disputes the main occupation of the people living in villages in india is agriculture since agriculture is primarily a land based activity disputes relating to land are common in villages the farmer working in the field and getting ready to sell his product in the market let us observe the following picture to understand how land disputes occur and the mechanism in place to resolve them station head officer or sho is the person in charge of any police station so what is the role of the sho area of police station every police station has an area that comes under its control all persons in that area can report cases or inform the police about any theft accident injury fight etc it is the responsibility of the police of that station to enquire to investigate and take action on the cases maintenance of land records measuring land and keeping land records and updating them is the main work of patwari let me discuss the role of patwari the patwari is known by different names in different states some of those names are lekpal kanungo karmchari are village officer each patwari is responsible for a group of villages the patwari usually has ways of measuring agricultural fields in some places a long chain is used the patwari is also responsible for organizing the collection of land revenue from the farmers and providing information to the government about the crops grown in that area this is why it's important for patwari to regularly update the records all states in india are divided into 
distance. First of all, the country will be divided into states. Then all states in India are divided into districts. These districts are further divided into small areas called Tehsil and Taluka. At the head is district collector and under him are revenue officers also known as Tehsildars. Tehsildars supervise the work of Patwari and ensure that the records are properly kept and the land revenue is collected. They make sure that farmers can easily get a copy of their record and students can get their caste certificates etc. The Tehsildar office is where land disputes are also here. In some states records are now being computerized and also kept at panchayat office so that they are more easily available and regularly updated. Hindu Succession Amendment Act 2005 In earlier times, women were not given ownership of the land even when they used to work on the fields. After the death of the father, his property was divided equally only among his sons. Thus, wives and daughters of deceased men were helpless. They then lived on the mercy of others. Recently, the law was changed. In the new law, sons, daughters and their mothers can get an equal share in the land. This law applies for all states and union territories of the country. This will benefit a large number of women. Now, when women have a share of their land, they have a strong the position in society. They can depend upon their share of the land for their livelihood. Thank you students.